And this is Ben with coenergicoticarry.net. And in this video, I'm gonna give you a list of 12 things that could make your hives worse. So if you're doing any of these 12 things or if you know any of these 12 things apply to you, you might wanna take them into account and that could be why your hives are worse. So, okay, number one, moving. Sometimes people report that their coenergic urticaria, which is a type of heat hives, become worse when they've moved or taken a certain vacation and they can also sometimes improve when they do that so that's something to keep in mind if you've re recently moved to a different climate or moved to a vacation spot or moved to an area you may notice your hives become worse or better not sure exactly what happens because there's so many factors everything from humidity to barometric pressure to the water quality to the climate so i mean just so many factors there that could be at play it's hard to say why that happens but some people report that moving has an effect on their hives and it could make them worse another thing is winter season if you notice that your hives are getting worse it could be because it's winter time it's colder outside the humidity levels are lower your body's not sweating as much so when you do become hot your body just is almost overloaded on histamine and acetylcholine it seems like and your body just goes into a crazy hives attack some people with cold energy to carry only have it in the winter so that's something to keep in mind if your hives are worse it could be because the seasons have changed and now it's cooler weather another thing that can make them worse is alcohol people with cold energy to carry a lot of people have reported on the forum that when they drink alcohol the next day or two their hives get dramatically worse and i'm not sure exactly why that is or a couple of reasons that could be at play one it sort of uh, has a vasodilation effect and the blood could flow to your skin more quickly, which makes it heat up and it could cause hives in that way. Another thing, there could be something in the alcohol itself that actually causes a, sort of an allergic reaction or something like that that intensifies your hives. Not sure exactly what it is about alcohol, but a lot of people, they notice that when they drink alcohol the next day or two, they, their hives will dramatically get worse. And that also goes for recreational drugs. I'll just throw that out there. You, you know, your body, you only got one body in this life. My advice to you, I'm not gonna preach at you, but my advice to you is watch the recreational drugs. I wouldn't do them myself. I don't do any recreational drugs or alcohol or smoking or nothing because I know how serious this hives disorder has been in my life and I wanna take care of my health as much as possible. So if you're doing any recreational drugs, alcohol, watch that, it can make your hives much worse. Another thing is being sick. If you get the flu or some cold or strep throat or something, I always notice that would make my hives dramatically worse. And I think the reason is, is because your hypothalamus is responsible for regulating your body temperature. And when you have a fever, and when you have a fever from some illness, then your body temperature is kind of a limo. It's going up and down. Your hypothalamus is struggling to try to keep it and you know raise that temperature a little bit to kill the virus or bug in your body. And I think that really messes with people's hives. So that's something that always bothered me. If you get sick, that could be why your hives are worse. Another thing, take note of your clothing. If you're wearing dark or thick clothing, that could be why your hives are bothering you lately. You know, if you're wearing a black t-shirt out on an 80 degree summer day, you're gonna heat up really quickly. And so just watch the clothing. You might want to watch the hats and the socks because you know your body body heat escapes from your head and your foot feet so if you're wearing a thick toboggan and some socks your body temperature is going to get hotter quicker which could induce an attack another thing is bad quality of water if you have an area if you live in an area with horrible water quality with you know it's really hard water with builds up a lot of scale on your shower and so forth then you may want to look into either a shower filter which are very inexpensive you can get them usually for 15 to 30 dollars or a water softener that's a little bit more pricey usually runs from two to four hundred dollars or both of those and those things can help reduce the chemicals and chlorine and so forth in your water and make your water quality dramatically better bad water can irritate your skin especially if there's some chemical that you're actually allergic to another thing that can make your hives worse is dry skin and this especially comes again into play in the winter time when it's cool, your skin's not sweating as much. You may want to use lotion more, maybe take less showers. And when you are taking a shower, maybe turn it down a little bit, not have it as hot so that heat doesn't leach your skin and the oils out of your skin and dry it out. Dry skin, I always notice would make my hives worse. They never, you know, having good quality skin won't cure your hives, but it can make your reactions a little less intense. 
Another thing is taking any kind of NSAID like ibuprofen or aspirin. That can have sort of like a blood thinning effect on your body or, or decrease inflammation. And I always found that those types of medications could make my hives a little bit more, uh, just a little bit more prickly and itchy than say if I took a Tylenol. Yet another thing is a bad diet. If you eat a diet high in salt, high in sugar, you're eating foods that you may even be allergic to because you're eating such a wide range of diet, that can make your hives worse. The biggest thing that helped my hives was my allergy elimination diet that I've talked about in another video. That's really what cured my hives. So if you're having issues with hives or co-energy care to carry in particular, definitely spend a lot of time, research some allergy elimination diets or watch my video and see what worked for me. And you may want to try that. Talk to a doctor first to make sure it's safe. Another thing that can make your hives worse is stress. And some people think that stress can cause hives and it may, I don't know if it can cause hives or not. Maybe it can, maybe it can't. But I do know that stress can make hives worse because it just seemed like anytime I would get super stressed or super anxious, not only can that induce an attack, but it also seemed to make the level of my attacks worse. Another thing that can worsen your hives is pregnancy. A lot of pregnant women will develop hives for the first time in their life because all the hormone changes going on inside of their bodies. And if you're a woman thinking of becoming pregnant or currently pregnant, then you know you don't know how that's going to affect your hives. It may make your hives worse, may make them better. Who knows what the hormonal changes can do? But there has been several women report on the forum that their hives did worsen during pregnancy, and I've also read that online. So that's something you want to watch out for. And the last thing is birth control pills or any kind of pills you're taking for like hormone therapy or anything like that. That can definitely have an impact on your hives. A lot of people have reported that. Anytime you're changing the hormone levels of your body, it can throw a lot of things out of whack. So just always be careful with that. If there's an alternative method that you can use other than birth control pills, I would highly recommend you look into that, especially if you think birth control pills are causing your body to break out in hives or be more sensitive. So that wraps up this video. Those things can make your hives worse, so watch out for them. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day.